We are excited to announce online 2016-2017 Back to School forms powered by InfoSnap for the upcoming school year. This online process replaces the paper form sent home at the beginning of each school year. The completion of these forms are vital to your student's safety and security in the school throughout the year. Your student safety is our utmost priority and our ability to provide for the safety and security depends on the completion of these forms before the deadline. The deadline to complete forms is August 1st, 2016. We hope this brief tutorial video will help you flow through the steps of this new process with ease. We're going to walk you through using the back to school forms. Here's where you sign in. Here's where you enter information about your student. You see that some information has already been filled in. It snapped over from last year's forms. More information about the parents and guardians. Remember, any area with a red dot needs to be completed. Here's where you fill out information for your emergency contacts. Here's a note about document uploads. You need two types of documentation and a poor medical form and proof of residency. This information is very important to staff and school nurses. Transportation, where does your child get picked up and when? Does your student go straight home on the bus? Here's where you tell the school system where they go and who's responsible for them. This is the agreements area where you can indicate you have looked at various policies and agreements.
please note you can print out and review various agreements. A lot to read here, but it's all very important. Here's where you and your student electronically sign the document. Almost done. Now it's time to review the document. Clicking on the red text takes you right back to where the mistake is. You can review all the information here. Here's another area we missed that needs to be fixed. We missed this, we need to be sure to fill that out. Review it carefully and hit submit. There you go. This is confirmation that your submission was accepted. Be sure to click on save and log out at the top of the screen to make sure all your information is saved. Upon completion of this form, your students, school administrators will have the most accurate information to contact you. In case of emergency, they'll have updated medical information and bus transportation. In addition, this process will allow your child to use electronic devices in school. Middle school and high school students and parents will have access to Parent Portal with its schedules and grades. Elementary school parents will have access to Parent Portal with students' attendance and teacher email links. Parent Portal will be turned back on on August 15th for parents and students who have completed the forms online.